Hi and welcome to Robins. In this film I'm going to talk you through the features of our Lodge 3 which is in our trail range. Now the Lodge 3 is a dome style tent which has this traverse pole on top to make sure that you're getting excellent head height all the way across the tent. It sleeps three people. With the tent being in our trail collection you'll find that the fly sheet is our Hydrotex HD which means it's a high density material, it's a 75 denier polyester it has PU coating on the inside, fully taped seams and a hydrostatic head of 5,000 millimetres and it's been treated to make sure that it's fire retardant as well. And one extra little bit of detail on here is that we do emboss this honeycomb print on the outside just for that little bit extra detail. The frame of the tent is made from DAC alloy poles. Now these are T6 anodised alloy poles so they are very lightweight but they're also very strong. And with them being anodised it means they're not going to corrode quite uh, as much as you would expect other alloy poles to. With them being DAC poles, you'll find that we're using DAC components. So just here we have the ball cap, which just allows you really simple, easy pitching. It just clips into place. On the inside, you'll find the frame, or the main frame for the tent is in here. This is an inner pitching first tent. So what we do is we put these poles together with the inner tent using the uh, twist clip hooks just on here, very simple and easy to do and then you'll just see that the fly sheet is attached to the poles using velcro tabs as well. Then the fly sheet at the bottom is just attached on with these quality buckles here. Other features you'll find on the outside we have the Robins red guy lines which have got uh, reflective points all the way through them so when you've got your head torch on you should be able to see these nice and easily and each guy line also has a clam cleat guy runner on here so very simple to adjust we can just do like so and then what you'll find is when it goes to tighten up it will actually self lock in place. Now each of these guy lines has its own retainer so when it comes to packing down the tent we can just wrap this up in our hand and pop it in here so that next time we come to use the tent they're easily accessible. Other features we'll find on the outside we have these pretty unique vents at the top of the tent obviously that's going to allow cool fresh air in here and keep you nice and comfortable but what's really smart about these is that these can be accessed from the inside of the inner tent thanks to zipped panels there which allows you to close these vents if you get a little bit too cold without having to get out of the tent. There is some low level ventilation too and um, just under here you'll find that there's a toggle so this can actually be rolled up completely and toggled closed um, to allow cool fresh air into the bottom of the tent and with the top ventilation as well you'll find that you get really good through flow of air within there. So coming around to the front you'll see here that we have this large porch area again that's thanks to this traversed ridge pole on top and there is a porch on both sides next to both entrances. If you don't want this large porch area then what we can do is roll this panel up you see there's a toggle point here but you can also roll the larger panel back too so you can actually open this up completely. Coming into the inside of the tent we have a breathable polyester inner and you'll see here that the door very handily rolls away and stows in this pocket at the side and there is two doors on this tent so they both have that same feature. We also have some mesh storage pockets on the inside as well and you'll see that the door at the back here we have zipped closed the mosquito net just uh, to highlight the fact that that's there. At the top of the tent you'll find that we have a mesh gear loft and the ventilation access zips that we mentioned earlier on. The ground sheet that we're using in this inner tent is a 75 denier polyester so a good heavy duty material and that has a hydrostatic head of 10,000 millimetres. So that's pretty much all the features of our Lodge 3 and I'd like to thank you very much for watching.